नहीं थे क्वेश्चन वी आर गिवन सिक्स मेट्रिसेज पी वन पी टू पी थ्री पी फोर पी फाइव एंड पी सिक्स एंड पी वन इज आई ना वी हैव डिफाइंड दिस मेट्रिक्स एक्स एज दिस सम के वेरीज फ्रॉम वन टू सिक्स पी के एंड देन सपोज दिस मेट्रिक्स से ए एंड ए वी हैव टेकन एज टू वन थ्री जीरो वन टू एंड थ्री टू वन एंड देन पी के ट्रांसपोज ना वील स्टार्ट विथ बी एक्स इज अमेट्रिक मेट्रिक्स ना इफ वी टेक इट्स ट्रांसपोज देन एक्स ट्रांसपोज इल बी दिस समेशन के वेरीज फ्रॉम वन टू सिक्स पी के ए पी के टी ट्रांसपोज which by reversal law will be transpose of pk transpose and then a transpose and pk transpose now transpose of transpose it is simply pk now this a it is a symmetric matrix elements are symmetric about diagonal so it will be simply a and it will be pkt that means x transpose it is simply equal to x which means this x is a symmetric matrix now this p1 is i and if you look at this p2 this p2 is 1 0 0 001 and 0 10 now if we interchange these two rows then this p2 will become i and if we interchange these two rows in i it will become p2 so basically we can write i into p2 equals p2 and if we use elementary operation interchanging r2 and r3 now this i will become p2 and p2 will become i so basically inverse of p2 is p2 itself so we can write p2 inverse will be equal to p2 and this p2 it is a symmetric matrix so basically it is also equal to its transpose in the same way if we use elementary operation in p3 then if we interchange r1 and r2 it'll become i and if we interchange r1 and r2 in i it will become p3 so basically all these given matrices p2 p3 p4 p5 and p6 they are self inverse so for any pi it is equal to pi transpose and it'll be equal to P I inverse. Now basically we can write this x as this summation k varies from one to six. P K into A into P K inverse. Now we know that trace of x will be this summation k varies from one to six. Trace of P K A into P K inverse. Now for this, what we'll do is we already know that trace of A B is same as trace of B A. So basically, we can write trace of P K A P K inverse will be trace of A P K inverse into P K. Now P K into P K inverse is I. So basically, it'll be equal to trace of A. So Trace of this matrix X will be equal to this summation k varies from one to six. Trace of A. Now this is independent of k, so it'll be simply six times trace of A. Now what is trace of A? Trace of A is two plus zero plus one, which is three, and six into three is eighteen. So we can write sum of diagonal entries of X is eighteen, and that's your option C. For this option D, we are given X into One one one. It is equal to alpha into one one one. Now basically, this x is this summation p k a p k into one 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 and alpha into one one one. Now if we multiply any p k with one one one. so basically 
I into 111 is 111. If we multiply this with 111, it'll be 1, 1, and 1. So since every matrix has only one 1 in every row, so this product will always be 1, 1, and 1. So we can write this as this summation PK into A into 1, 1, 1, and it'll be equal to this alpha. 1 1 1 now since multiplication is distributive we can write this as this summation pk into a into 1 1 1 will be equal to alpha into 1 1 1 now if we add all pi's it will be 2 2 2 2 2 2 and then it will be 2 2 2 and then we have this a and this a is 2 1 3 1 0 2 3 2 1 into 1 1 1 and it will be equal to alpha 1 1 1 now we multiply this this is basically sum of all elements in a row so it will be 2 2 2 2 2 2 and then 2 2 and 2 and here it will be 6 3 and 6 and it will be alpha into 1 1 and 1 and we multiply this it will be 12 plus 6 18 18 plus 12 30 so this product will be simply 30, 30, and 30, and this is alpha into 1, 1, 1. Now we can write this as alpha into 1, 1, 1 will be equal to 30 into 1, 1, 1. So one of the possible value of alpha is 30, which means this option D is also correct. Now if in this option D we put alpha is 30, we can write this as x minus 30i into 1 1 1 will be equal to 0. Now this is a x equals 0 which is a homogeneous equation and clearly this x it is unequal to 0. So determinant of x minus 30i it must be equal to 0. So x minus 30i it is a singular matrix and therefore it is not invertible. So the correct options are B, C and D. Hello and welcome to the world of mathematics. I present my website www.mathsmarizing.com and my YouTube channel Mathsmarizing for your kind perusal. If you like them and are inspired by the possibilities, then consider subscribing and sharing it with someone you know who might benefit from it. Thank you.